All right, guys, welcome back to eBay for Beginners Q&A. Here is the question of the day. Any ideas of what to do and how to overcome this? I messaged buyer, why does eBay let people make offers without paying? Now I can't get any offers on my items. And then a few words I'm not gonna repeat here, or letters or whatever. But uh, here's the screenshot. So as you can see here, someone has accepted an offer and the buyer still hasn't paid for the item. There was an update, it was put out a couple of months ago. If the buyer doesn't pay immediately, the item still stayed in your store for other people to be able to look at the item and uh, be able to purchase it also. That was an update they did. Uh, it's been a couple of months, two or three months ago, but I have seen personally that not be the case. That might have happened on maybe one or two of my items since then, but most of my items, like your item, apparently is still sitting in the not paid section, and so it's not able to uh, be able to be viewed by other buyers. That is frustrating, and I get that. But here's something to think about. The item will sit for four days unless you cancel it yourself which I don't recommend canceling orders. I never cancel orders uh, unless the buyer tells me to cancel orders because then I can click that option, uh, buyer requested cancellation, and then that doesn't ding my account. I just may personally, if I feel like I cancel any order, it's gonna ding my account unless I choose that other option. So when this happens, I let the item sit for four days. When the item sits for four days and no payment has been made, it will automatically uh, eBay will automatically cancel the order. The buyer will receive a ding on their account for non-payment. Now, something you can do in them four days, and I have done this, you can actually send a payment reminder to them. I've done it in the morning when I've got up. I've done it in the, uh, in the evenings before I went to bed, twice a day until they pay for it, if it's after two days, if it doesn't see any kind of activity or whatever on that. So a lot of people say use the pay now later option. Uh, you can use that when you list your items you have an option to click the buyer must pay now uh, you can use that but that still does not stop this to happening but if you're, if you're one of them sellers that sells multiple items I would not recommend that because then that goes back to they can put a whole bunch of items in their store and then they can send you an invoice or you can send them an invoice for combined shipping that's another whole new thing there but as far as this question goes here me personally, I, each day I would send them a notification letting them know that they need, I'm ready to ship the item, I need payment on it. Uh, if they don't pay in four days, it's automatically canceled, it's automatically relisted into your store, and the buyer gets a ding on their account for non-payment. And then for future reference, as a seller, I would go ahead and block that person for the simple fact that they didn't pay for the item. If they're going to shop and not pay, then, then I don't need them at my store. So that was the question of the day. I hope this helped whoever asked that question out. I hope this was beneficial to you. And if there's anyone else that's watching this, I hope this information was beneficial to you that you may be able to use it. Again, a lot of you guys that watch me, uh, you, you are experts in uh, reselling. Y'all know everything. I'm not being sarcastic. I mean, y'all are a lot more knowledgeable than I am. I'm being real on that. So the, this series of videos here that I'm doing, this playlist, will probably not be for y'all. And I apologize for that. I will be putting out other videos. Hey, guys, tonight is 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Carrie, American Arbitrage, will be on our show, Picking and Grinning. Uh, we got a great show coming up. If any of you new eBay sellers or any of you old eBay sellers, you want to come by and join us, man, come by and join us. Kerry's a great guy. He has a lot of good information. Feel free to drop your questions in. We'll be live on Facebook and YouTube. So we're looking forward to seeing you guys tonight. Other than that, we'll see you tomorrow for the next question.